Sehwag, 78 versus Hong Kong, only on 44 deliveries. 100 versus Pakistan, that was a great innings. Here we go. Ooh, nicely played on a back foot outside edge for one. Not, in, not as much as swing to the right hander. Oh, there you go. That's the one. Anything slightly up in that zone. And I'll tell you what, he's going to throw everything at it. Doesn't quite get all of this. Happy with two. What is he doing? Pitch up, he will have a go at you. They didn't matter it though, but got a couple in the end. Here he goes. Oh, and a misfield. That's a shame for Sri Lanka. Because that would have been another dot ball to add to more pressure. Just lets that pressure off. And Pollock. Slow delivery, nicely played. The fine lag is wider. This will go all the way for four. And the crowd is roaring as well. Yeah, I don't agree with that uh, fine leg being that wide with the new ball. And no too dangerous asking for too much from the bowler. You see, that's just orthodox fine leg right there. Change of pace from the bowler. He's going to hit you like this. Amazingly played shot by Sewa Guzon Song once again. Slightly up. This is more orthodox. See, the feet don't go, but he's got such good hand-eye coordination. He just hits through the line. Look at the feet. They hardly move. Fine league has come up inside the circle, though. And that is just what he loves. Look at it. Holds the pose for the photo. Straight back past the bowler for four more. Magnificent. Played with the straight bat. That was his third four of the over. You can't put fielder there. A bowler's back drive over the over the head of the bowler. Couple of fences. This is beauty. Look at the follow through there. A punch. And the shorter one. This is uh, down a fine leg. Not good bowling. Four fours in the over. 16, 27 without loss. Oh, this is edge. Drop. Probably go all the way for four. We'll have a look at the replay. But uh, little half chance this. I think it's just too much. But there, the stroke was induced. Got a glove on it, did Sangakara. But just what you were on about, Wazi Makram. No third man, so he was hunting up looking for the old ramp shot up and under. Now the third man is gone. It's almost like uh, play follow the ball. Horse may have bolted a little bit. There you go, he's pre off stump. And they're going to change the pace, and it's beaten. The man up inside the circle, and his third man up, and it's cost him dearly. That was a great shot. There's a reason, because he played that shot purposely. He knew the third man was up. He waited for the ball, opened the face of the bat, and created a gap between the third short third man fielder and a point region there. There were two of them there, and it was placed... And that'll be four more. Too easy to improvise with a bowler of Vasa's pace. Saw the ball pitching short and then knew the knew the fine leg. Oh, and this is a dangerous little slog shot that he'll probably get four for. Yes, he does. There was a big move over mid wicket on a slow delivery. But there was his 8, 4 and 3rd from this over. Shivinda Vaz is getting hammered here by Sehwag. He just wants to keep this momentum going, does uh, Brinda Sehwag. He's taken on the ballers. He doesn't care whether India has, a, has lost the wicket or not. He's going after ballers. Here's another one. This is his ninth boundary. And he's on 46. Excellent footwork. Allowed him to place that ball away from the fieldsman placed. A short fine leg. Muthaya Murli Dharan. Another one. What a shot. Great timing and great 50 from Berinda Sehbag. Under pressure. Just 26 deliveries he consumed to get there. 29 ODI 50, 
and coming in in very quick time. What an innings. This is the final and he has uh, played some beautiful strokes. Ten boundaries in that innings of 50 so far from Virendra Sehwag. The previous one was on the onside, this one on the offside. Once again, the weight and cracked to the boundary. Look at that timing. Chance of a run out. Down the leg side, four. You just have to wait and see whether that came off the bat. Yes, it did. More. Have the ball on its way. Final two. That's why I picked up four runs. Comes down the wicket and gone. What a wicket. He's done it. This is a great breakthrough for the Sri Lankans. Ajanta Mendes has done the trick. He didn't go to Muthaya Murlitharan, the most experienced bowler and the highest wicket taker in one day international for Sri Lanka. He went for the youngsters, youngster Mendes. He went on the punt and it has paid. He has picked up Varendra Sehwag. Always a big wicket. And look at that reaction. That's what you wanted, Captain. You got it. Game on. Varendra Sehwag gone for 60. It's 76 for two.